Welcome back ladies and gentlemen to the channel. My name is Sky and we have been getting such amazing feedback from all the dual breakdown videos. We are so glad we've had the opportunity to teach you everything that we know so far in New World. Because of that, this is the first official launch of our new series, Legends of Eternal. Hope you enjoy. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, so to kick off this first episode, we're versing a Warhammer Great Axe user. Now, this specific player is very, very high skilled. He's very good at feinting my reposts. He's very good at landing his stuns, and he knows how to combo his weapons together very well to completely annihilate anyone in melee. He's also very accurate with his abilities, and he knows how to dodge very well. So in this particular matchup, it is not going to be easy to down this guy and, you know, be able to win the series. So let's talk about some oh, of yeah. our keys to victory here. We're going to try to stay out of melee range as much as we can. The only way we're going to get in melee range is if we have repost or at least flesh to get us out of that sticky situation. After that, we're going to make sure that if by chance we are out of rolls, we evade backwards. So we would, ev we would swap from out of our musket onto our rapier evade backwards to almost give us a roll back and then we would swap back to the musket and get off lock and load procs as much as possible. We're also going to start the duel with a powder burn locked and loaded so we also have one on cooldown as well. Another key tip for when you fight melee in general is that unless you have kill potential after you land the repose stun, don't go for repose damage. I would recommend that you know after you repose stun you Instantly take out your musket and land a trap. Now doing that gives you 20% more damage while they're trapped and it also gives you 100% of the healing you do to them while they're trapped. And lastly, it keeps them off of you for an additional 2-3 to three seconds after the stun. So you could repost, take out your musket, trap them, shoot them two times, and heal for the damage that you deal. So it's a very powerful combo against melee that I've used a lot in this matchup. So, let's start off this duel. Here we go. We start the duel. We miss our first burning shot. We get the next lock and load. Now, with that ground slam ability that he just used, you could sidestep the animation and dodge it completely. You don't dodge forward. You don't dodge backwards. You go left or right. You either dodge one of those ways and you'll negate the animation completely. Let's keep moving. We're loading up. We miss, unfortunately. He pulls us in. He misses the, the instant attack after the pull from the, from the talent ability because we dodge. We're dodge and we're already on the move. I evade backwards and I'm dodging. I'm also getting as much energy as possible from using evade as well. We take out our musket, try to get a shot in. We flesh over him to get some damage and try to backstab. We miss, unfortunately. He throws out a gravity well. Now in this situation, I already use my flesh, so I'm, I'm going to finish off this reload. I'm going to take out my rapier and either evade dodge him or repose him. Let's see what I do. I take out the rapier. I press repost. He anticipates it. Good players can anticipate your reposts and make you absolutely pay for it. Now, I press repost. I realize that he's not biting on it, so I need to get out of there before he stuns me. I roll out and immediately evade and roll again. I'm starting my lock and loads. He pulls me. He almost kills me with two swings, but I land a trap on him. So if I can get a couple shots off here, I can get some health back and be nice and healthy. I missed the first shot. Very unfortunate. Second shot, I land, I heal for a thousand. I use my healing potion, he uses his as well. And now I'm kiting again. I see that he uses the ground slam and I already have my rapier out. So I'm going to try to evade and roll forward to get a quick instant attack and then get out of there. So I attack, I leave, I swap right back to my musket, I get lock and loads off. And I'm using evade and roll efficiently to just keep moving back. Keep moving them towards me until I have a great play to make him pay for it. 
So we back up. He pulls me in, misses that. Misses the second swing. I flesh through him. I evade and roll backwards and instantly take out my musket for lock and loads. So we're going to shoot, roll, trap, miss the gravity well because I dodge. Hoping, I was also hoping that he was going to land in the trap. He unfortunately didn't. I get the shot off. And now I repost. I thought he was going to bull rush me and melee attack me. But he did a another ground slam ability. And the repost animation, I guess, just missed it. So now he has a free swing on me. He oh hits me. Oh my god, no way. I trap him again. So right now, I need to take advantage of the situation that he's trapped. And I can get two shots off and heal completely from them. So let's see what happens. I roll back, shoot, roll, shoot. So just from those two attacks... I healed for about 1,800, 1,900 damage. Without that, this game would have been over. Just me landing that trap and healing from that just turned the tables on this whole fight. He uses his charge while he's trapped as well. So now he has no gap closer. So right now, I'm feeling very, very comfortable. I'm reloading. I'm good. Now, I realize that he's low on stamina. And I realize he's not pushing me as well. So I'm going to load up a power burn and hopefully land it on him. If I do, I think I can outduel him with my rapier and finish off this fight. I load it up. Somehow, I don't know how that missed, but somehow it did. He pulls me in. I'm immediately going to roll out. I'm going to shoot. Immediately swap to my rapier. Flesh through him. Try to get a backstab. I miss. And then I'm going to get out of there. When you're playing the rapier and musket... You take what you can get at all times. It's not a weapon where you can get greedy. It's, it's where you, you take advantage of the opponent's mistakes, capitalize, and get the heck out. That's it. It's all about counterplay with this weapon combo. I take out my musket. I reload. Shoot. Reload. Shoot. I think I can finish him off, so I take out my rapier. I repost, thinking he's going to attack or stun me instantly. He faints the repost again. Now, he is very, very good at timing that repost. A lot of players wouldn't be, but in the case that you do find a player like this, you can either cancel the animation with an evade or just spam shift backwards to get out of there. I spam shift backwards. I get a lock and load proc. End of the duel. Let's move on to the second one. So, we start off the duel. I miss my powder burn again but I get the lock and load. Now, he charges. He hits me for 1,000. I also connect within a lunge evade forward for 800. I repost. He faints the repost again. Once again, very skilled players are going to know that, hey, this rapier player is coming up close to me. I'm just going to hold off, wait, and capitalize right when that repost is over. So I realize that I'm, shift, I'm spamming dodge to get the heck out. I get out. He misses the uh, ground slam, but he hits the earthquake. So now I'm stuck there for a second, and I have a slow debuff on me. Wow, he's predicting my I'm going to try now. to connect as many shots as possible. I use my evade to dodge the stun, but the hit still gets registered on me. So I back, for I back roll. I throw down a trap. He moves out of the way of the trap. He pulls me in. And right now, I'm just trying to buy some time until I'm feeling more comfortable. I need to get him running toward me blindly so I can capitalize on a play. I also have my potion up, and I have repost up. So right now, I'm feeling kind of safe. I'm going to get my lock and load procs okay. and shoot him as okay. much as I can. He potions, so I'm going to run back and counter that with mine. He charges and misses. I'm going to try to get a quick stab in and get out of there. I miss, oh, he hits me with an ability. Right after that, he hits me with the ground slam or aftershock. Let me know what the ability is in the comments. I, I forgot what the name is. He hits me with it. He pulls me in. And now I am one shot. I was maybe 0.2 seconds too late on my repost. And now I, I if I get hit with anything, I'm dead. The pull in, the... The ground slam, the aftershocks, anything. I'm a dead man. So I need to stun him and either A, trap, 
or B, get the heck away from him. He blocks the repose stun. I hit him with a heavy attack. He throws down a gravity well, as you can see on the right side of the animation. He throws it out. I dodge the gravity well. I use evade to get more energy. I get a lock and load off. And right now, I am running for my life. Now is not the time to play games or get any more damage in. After my lock and loads, I am running for my life. So now I pull out the musket. I throw down traps to try to, to try to keep him off of me. He charges around the trap. I dodge the charge. And now I'm evading and fleshing away to get some distance. I'm waiting for the reload. Now I got a lock and load. And I hit him in the head as he's pulling me in. Now, this was an incredibly, incredibly close duel. Let's pull that back one more time. I miss the shot. I reload. I shoot him again, and right as he's going to use that pull-in animation, I hit him right in the skull with that musket, which won me the duel there. Now, just remember, ladies and gentlemen, the rapier in musket is the best weapon combo in the game at countering your opponents. It's so strong at making them pay for making mistakes and, and just capitalizing and not really having anything bad else happen to you. You could really just capitalize with repost, using traps, all the deadly combos in your arsenal to really make someone pay for making a mistake. One thing to Seems emphasize around. in this duel was that evade, now using it defensively desperate. and as a movement either backwards or side to side, saved me multiple times in these duels. And also fleshing the get around him backstab and then get out, that, all, that was also a lot of damage that helped me as well. You just gotta remember that when that duel starts, try to land that powder burn for that damage over time. And then maybe, you know, eventually you'll have a chance to to duel him one-on-one -on -one with, with your rape here. But, but overall, Great Axe, Great Axe, any other weapon is very hard for us. I personally think it's a counter, but, you know, uh, these videos are really intended to just give you the best tips possible and to give you the knowledge that would help you to taking out people like this. Uh, shout out to Toxic Reaper. He is an amazing, amazing player. He beat me a ton of times too, by the way. It was honestly like a 50-50 series, but I'm, I'm just showing you guys what I did and, you know, what won me those cl very close fights. I want to thank you all for stopping by for this video. I appreciate every one of you who comment, like, and subscribe. My name is Sky, and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace. Oh my god, no way!